Well, hello today. Today I'm not in the garage. I'm in the backyard. And what I'm doing is I'm working on, I'm starting to work on the upholstery for the old car. And uh, I know I'm doing things weirdly out of order, but I'm kind of frustrated with the mechanics of the car right now because the radiator has just proved to be really bad. So I'm gonna move on to the seats for a while just to do something different. As you can see here, this is the back this is the back of the back seat. And I didn't replace any of the springs in here. I just checked for broken wires and so on. I cleaned it up inside there and spray painted it uh, silver after I treated the rust. And I built this new hardwood frame based on the old one. I've got the deck padding on here. So basically, this is supposed to sit up like that. It could be the back rest of the back seat. And because I have my new sewing machine, just let me grab this here. I was able to sew based on the old piece. I've sewn this cover for it with the channels. And it took me a while to figure out exactly how to do this. At first I just sewed lines straight down between the backing material and the uh, fabric, but that doesn't, that's not really the way it's supposed to work. It's called tuck and roll. And you're supposed to do, you're supposed to do pleats where you fold this over, sew a line and then fold it back. And I managed to do that. So this is my cover. And what I'm gonna be doing right now is I'm gonna be stretching it on there and stapling it down and trying to get it even. And I'll work on it for a while and then let you know how it comes out. Meanwhile, later in the day, it's starting to not look too bad. Even put one of the buttons on there just to see what it looks like. Eh, it's not perfect, but it's okay. But the issue I'm having is, let me tilt this back. Hang on a second. Yeah. I didn't like the way it looked where this met that. So what I've done is I just went and bought some vinyl, similar colored vinyl. I'm going to attach it along here. I'm going to also put a little extra stuffing in here in each one. And then I'm going to be able to uh, stretch from here down to here and get a nice smooth edge on the bottom. So that's my next step. Well, and there she be. It's not too bad. Not the greatest job ever, but because the top is a little bit dimply. But it's not bad. You can see what I did on the bottom here. Wait a minute, let me flip this over here. actually put I went to the fabric store and bought some vinyl and hand stitched it along the bottom here and then I put a I put a board here because I wanted it to be stretched flat and straight it's not the greatest edge down here but it doesn't really matter it's gonna be that's where the other uh, part of the seats gonna join so I think it's okay that's it she's a done for the day